tough. Um, it, I, it, it's been most often said by Joe Black, I even think Michael, certainly our buddy Bob, and I, I guess I'm in agreement with it, just the interaction with some of the folks. You know, the musicians, a lot of them were a delight to talk to. They come in with different uh, opinions about things, presidential, other, you know, it's just... And, and then just being around that much creativity, that much music. You know, I'd sit through roughly anywhere from eight to 20 bands a night, you know, playing music simultaneously. So my ability to hear music is very much like a, a, a Gray's Anatomy book where you open it up and you have the uh, bones and then you lay up a transfer over that and you got the uh, nervous system and that's kind of like the way I hear music anymore. It's just that it's almost all, it's very rare for me to hear one band at a time. And if I do hear one band, it often reminds me of so many other bands that I start layering them. <laughs> It's now a problem, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'll miss that. And we we were, we were doing a lot of stuff there. We were making a little well, we still are cigar box amplifiers, which is very cool. And to have musicians come in, and you, you're making a product that you could actually show them and say, "Hey, look, check this out. You, are you interested?" We were making guitar straps and ergonomically designed, you know, things for musicians. I mean, you know, it's pretty intense. Uh, and like one minute you could have Gerald Veasley come off the elevator, you know, phenomenal bass player, somebody that you would like to talk to about different things, and Jamaluddin Takuma, a lot of folks. So it's it's uh, definitely a change. I think we're pretty good. Cool. Good.